Hello and welcome to this video on creating LODs with morph targets in Unreal Engine. This is the guy we are going to use to create uh, LODs for. As you can see, we have a couple of morph targets. And we want some of these to be kept uh, during optimization, others we want to remove. So what we are going to do is we are going to right click, go to Simplygon and then create a LOD recipe. We name it character. Here we can see the LOD recipe um, window. We are going to add all of our character meshes. Uh, so we now have four characters assigned to our LOD recipe. Uh, for uh, for uh, reduction settings, we are just gonna go with uh, a standard ratio of 0 0.5 on the first one, 0 0.25 on the second, and lastly 0 0.12 on the last one. Uh, if we go down here, we can see that all of the morph targets are unchecked. That means that per default a generated LOD will not contain any morph targets. Uh, what we want to do is that we want to keep all morph targets for LOD 1, some for LOD 2 and none for LOD 3. So on uh, LOD 2 we want to keep the morph targets that are uh, give a huge visual impact. So for example Wink here gives a quite little impact. Uh, on the other hand, surprise give quite a large impact. So we are going to keep surprise and fear on this one. What we do is that we specify that for LOD 1, morph targets will be kept, and for LOD 2. Then we can go in per model and specify which morph target that we should keep. After that has been specified, we can build our LODs. Let's now look at the resulting mesh. We have LOD0, which is the original mesh, and here all uh, morph targets are. Uh, we have LOD1, here we also have all morph targets as specified. Then we have LOD2. Here we only have the morph target that we specified, so we can see that Disgust, Wink, Anger, Joy has no effect. On the other hand, Surprise and Fear is still here. And for the last LOD, here we don't have any morph targets. That's all for today. Thank you for listening. If you want to learn more about Simplygon, please follow our YouTube channel.